For the first step, we're going to head over to search and type in Windows Update Settings. Click on it. Once you're on it, click on Advanced Options, and then you want to click on Delivery Optimization, and then you want to turn this off. For the second step, we're going to head over to search and type in Services. Click on it. Once you're on it, click on any service and then click on S on your keyboard and then we're going to scroll down until we find sysmain. You want to disable this, so right click on it and then click on stop. And then right click on it again, click on properties and then make the startup type disabled and click on OK. For the third step, right click on the Windows Start icon and click on Task Manager. Once you're on it, we're going to head over to Startup Apps and then you'll disable all of the apps that you don't want to start when your computer turns on. The way to do that is by clicking on it and then click on disable. For the next step, we're going to head over to search and type in edit power plan. Click on it. Once you're on it, we're going to click on power options and then you want to select high performance if you have that or you may have all high performance. If you don't see it, then click on create a power plan and then you might have it here. And then click on next follow all the steps. If you still don't see it, then we're going to cancel this out. And then you want to click on the arrow right here and it might say it. But if you don't have it, then you could just stay on balance. For the next step, we're going to right click on the Windows Start icon, then click on Settings. Then we're going to click on Storage and then click on Storage Sense. Make sure that this is turned on and then click on Run Storage Sense now. After you do this, we're going to go back and then we're going to click on Clean Up Recommendations. And then Windows will recommend you everything that needs to be cleaned up. It will say it here and then you can just clean it up. For the last step, head over to Search and type in CMD, then we're going to run it as Administrator. And then click on Yes. Then we're going to type in SFC space forward slash scan now and click on Enter and then run the system scan. Once it's completed, restart your computer and your computer will be much faster.